Speaking of idiots, if I might, if I may, Marge Taylor Greene was not the only uh, maggot in uh, in the Capitol trying to steal uh, a little bit of a little FaceTime, a little news time, a little free PR. Um, George Santos, who just recently pled guilty. Hold on. Uh, Uh, let's see if I can find this real quick. I don't know if you guys know. Um, <laughs> Here you go. Uh, um, if you want to talk about like plea deals and whatnot, ra racking and rolling and whatnot, um, hold on, make this a little bigger, um, and then squeeze it down for you guys, um, if I may. Um, this is uh, George Santos accepts deal in Brazilian check fraud case. <laughs> yeah, yeah, the American congressperson had to take a plea deal in a Brazilian check fraud case, as you do. There he is, or whoever. Um, embattled New York representative George Santos has reached an agreement to settle a years-old criminal case against him in Brazil, according to a report from CNN. Santos reportedly reached a deal with the Brazilian prosecutors under which he will formally confess to check fraud and pay restitution. The freshman GOP lawmaker is accused of stealing a checkbook from an elderly person who his mother was caring for in 2010. He later admitted to forging checks from that checkbook to purchase items including clothing and shoes. A petition from his Brazilian attorney asks uh, to arrange a non-prosecution agreement, citing Mr. Santos' employment as a U.S. lawmaker and calling him re-socialized. <laughs> oh, I do. It's socialism. It's fucking socialism. He's been re socialismed I see. So Brazil is socialized now, and they, they have socialized everything, and so they're trying to make it look like he's been socialized. I see. I see. All right. Last year... Told New York Post he had never been charged with a crime in Brazil. I am not a criminal here, not here or in Brazil or any jurisdiction in the world. Absolutely not. That didn't happen. <laughs> that statement was not true. Brazilian authorities reopened the fraud case against him in January after they discovered that Mr. Santos, who'd left the country after being charged, had surfaced in the U.S. Boy, did he. Boy, did he fucking surface. Like a fucking Hydra submarine. George, Sa and this is from Breitbart too. George Santos snaps at media after making appearance to support Trump. You guys make it unbearable. Nah, you kind of, I'm just going to say, again, you fucked up. I'm done for you. That's my... <laughs> Uh, you working for Putin? Lock him up, police. Look at, it, look at this weird MAGA security detail. <laughs> you guys gotta move, you gotta move, move, move. Is he part of your security? Nah, he's just wearing a MAGA hat, so I let him, uh, I, I gave him five bucks to push me. Hey, Cross, what's up, bro? Where, where are we going with this? Where are you guys going? Yeah, I'm, I'm, taking him to my car. Okay. I'm taking him to my car. Does he know this? He looks shocked. I'm taking him to my car. I'm gonna put him in the trunk. You're what? What? Look at that. What? Oh my God, he's Brazilian. I'm being extradited. What's the message from the Trump department? Hey, Sean. Tell us your local constituents. Uh, <laughs> we love him. I love him. Oh, what's your message to Donald Trump? Uh, sir, you want to tell me about what's your you're message to Trump? Pushing me. Why? Well, well, you're pushing me. Why? Well, I mean, you're pushing me. Why should Donald Trump benefit from your presence? You don't want or so? Show me your license. Show me your license. You lying. I can't tell which I can't tell who's yelling at him, but it's but it's all fantastic. Get the fuck out of here! Oh my God, he's, he, he can't walk down the street in New York. Look at the crime; it's rampant. 
Of course, it's thought crime, but how can these people think that I don't deserve to be here? Locking up traffic. What's the message for Trump? You know what I've done really good? I've taken all of you away from there, so... Right. The Marjorie Taylor Green there! there. Marjorie Taylor Green just showed up, y'all! Marjorie Taylor Green just showed up, y'all! Yeah, she's there! I did my job, I took a few of them. Hey, your, uh, your, your body man is now behind you. Is he? T it looks like he's having trouble. I'm taking him my car! Where the fuck is my car? Where the fucking, did I leave it? 7th Street, right? 7th... Wasn't it? Shit! It's back that way. Fuck. You know how it's weird? When you walk all the way, you're like, Hey, I'll see you later! And then it turns out you're parked right next to each other. That's so embarrassing, I hate that. I'm out of there. Guys, watch out! Guys, watch out! Be careful. Seriously, you're walking backwards. This is terrible. What are you doing for me today as, as uh, your constituent? What do you think? Today is right stop, bro, now? Stop, stop. Yeah. What do you mean today? Like now? Like this day? Today. What? Define today, okay? So we're in recess. Okay. So what I've done the last two weeks, what I've done the last uh, three months, yeah. uh, working to secure over $40 million in aid for water projects in the district. Do you know that Farmingdale's... Farmingdale's... Uh, <laughs> Easy back there. 11 months away. Take your turn. Have, you know, I have to clean water, uh -huh. and that the former congressman knew about this and wasn't able to address it in, 2000, in 2021. Well, oh yeah, I remember that. Right, the former congressman wasn't able to address this um, because the uh, <laughs> the infrastructure bill hadn't been passed yet, and so he wasn't able to tack his name onto an infrastructure project that he had fuck all to do with. And you got it, and then you were able to go, look what I did for the district because of Biden's infrastructure bill. That's, that is, can, oh, this is kind of magic. Ladies and gentlemen, congratulations. We've stumbled upon bullshit in the wild. This is, um, it, when pressed by someone that is allegedly a constituent, and again, he has no way of knowing whether the guy really is or isn't, but he's assuming that he is, he takes the moment to bullshit his constituent about a, a money he got for the district because of Biden's infrastructure bill. Um, uh, uh, one of the wells in Farmingdale were, were decommissioned due to the Polytech uh, plant chemicals, uh -huh. and it was never put back into it was never put back into to work. Nor put back into work. You've read the bill. Yeah. Sure. Circulation, I think, is the word he was kind of hung for. So I get to see that. Or service. Yeah. And how about the western part of the county? Western part of Nassau County? Uh, I, I'm, I'm working on the entire county. I'm working on the whole fucking county. What do you want? Oh, God. I Can you please just... Look, I'm on my way to get a snack, and my blood sugar is dropping, and I hate this place, and fuck you. Okay, I'm working from the water projects in San Point. I, uh, I'm sorry to stop you here, boss. I don't remember where I parked. Do you remember what my car looks like? <laughs> yeah, they just started walking and didn't realize they'd walked <laughs> like a well-oiled machine. <laughs> Stay strong. The people are with him. Stay strong. The people are with him, meaning Trump, I think. I I'm doing nothing. I'm leaving. <laughs> are, you do you are you going to the memorial? And he's like, I'm doing nothing. I'm leaving. This place is ugh. Ugh. Are you coming back at all later? No, because you guys make it unbearable. Where <laughs> are you coming back later? No, because you guys make it unbearable for me. Jesus Christ, man. A, suck it up, buttercup. Take a fucking Uber where you're going. Get out where you're going and stop don't go for a stroll and as the biggest liar in congress known biggest known liar in congress and then bitch that people are following you around trying to catch you in another one which i just did but what i've decided to leave i've decided to leave just and and i wanted to before i got a chance to leave point out the fact that our car is parked in a handicap spot. <laughs> Just when we all thought you couldn't be 
more of an asshole. Oh my God, what a prick. I, that sums it up. Ladies and gentlemen, George Santos. Fucking hell. Yeah, that's for real. <laughs> I'm getting out of here. I couldn't find parking. This is lame. Whatever. Somebody was yelling at me. I couldn't see them because they were in a chair or something. But, um, what the fuck? Yes, that's not a meme. That's, that's video. Look, watch. But what? I didn't insert that shit. I don't have time for those kind of graphics. I decided to leave. You guys win. Look at that. I just, You're so proud of yourself. I, I just want to get your message. That's yeah. all. No, you don't. What, what would you say? <laughs> no, you don't. You want to know my messages? My fucking, why do handicapped people get all the best spots? That's my fucking message, right? <laughs> what a prick. Oh my God. And just fucking stop whining. God damn. These people. Just everything with these assholes is boo fuckity who. It just get like, I gotta say, it just gets fucking tiring like, at just how whingy they are. 